Welcome to Homes for Sale Atlanta with your real estate agent and advisor, Lorenzo Reed, with Remax Metro Cityside in Atlanta, Georgia. Today, we're at 156 Elite Road in Covington, Georgia, at a home that is selling for $349,900. This four bedroom, three and a half bath home is listed by JYB Realty, and the listing agent is Jennifer Rollins. So let's go take a look inside at this entertainer's delight. So before we enter this home, what I want you guys to be able to see is how the stonework has been laid in this front porch area and gives you a good front slab porch that you can entertain with your family, friends, and it gives you that space. Now notice the sort of Western style planking on the uh, windows as well as this door. That is an entertaining theme that we will see throughout this home. So come on inside and let's take a look. And as we walk in the door, you see it to your left. We have our dining room, our front dining room, with that western thing in the lighting. Very nice dark wood floors from our foyer and throughout the entire entirety of the uh, the main area of the home. This, the, every, almost everything is on this open style concept. Almost everything is on the main floor. We do have one bedroom upstairs, but this dining room flows into our family room. Now in this family room, you know, we have our fireplace built in, built in for entertaining and decorating and putting your books. Now we're also going to look at, we could go outside, but we're not going to go out that way yet because there's a special way that we're going to do that so you can understand the flow of this house even better. This is one thing I love. This eating kitchen featuring this western style really gives it that, hey, we're coming to the old town saloon, you know, and let's have a drink. Let's have some food. What do you serve, barkeep? You know. So well, from there, we go into our eat-in dining room. This is our eat-in kitchen, eat-in dining area. Plenty of spacing, enough for you to have a family of six that can sit into this area. And with an open concept into our kitchen, which we do have a nice kitchen that has been done with you know, the walnut color, um, cabinetry, woodwork with our granite top, and a nice great backsplash to go off of it. Now, we're not going to go to the master, that's the piece that I resist on, so we're going to wait for that one. But we'll flow through our kitchen, and from our kitchen, we go straight across into our laundry room. Now, I, you know I love my laundry rooms on the main floor where, I live, where the main bedroom is. But I love the fact that they took the extra effort to make the laundry room a part of the whole house, not just a separate throw off, but that they de designed it so that it fits with the entire home. But it's a great laundry room for you to be able to take care of all of your family needs and things of that nature. Now, over here, we flow into our mud room that comes right off of our two car garage. And while we're entertaining, we have our half bath over here. Now, since we're on this side of the house, let's go ahead and go upstairs and see the uh, one bedroom that is upstairs. Now, this is a great space for any child, older child, or just an office space, just away from everybody else. So let's go take a look at it. All right, guys, so we're gonna look at this one bedroom upstairs and we look at the, two, the other bedrooms downstairs. But look how big this room is. Whoever gets this room is going to have plenty of space for whatever they need to do. For whatever, they, however they want to live. This is almost like a home away from home for whomever uh, is placed up here or whatever you do. This could be a family entertainment space. This could be an upstairs living room space for you. It has a very large closet that goes with it. Little nooks for reading. A full bathroom. And you know, it also features, it has a good utility closet uh, right here and your, and has attic space storage. So that's this room upstairs. Let's go down, see the rest of the home 
So that you can see the other bedrooms, as well as something that I love from when I lived in Florida, and when I moved back to Atlanta, it was something that I had to have in my home. And I want you guys to see that same thing. So let's stick with the uh, our bedroom theme since we've seen one bedroom upstairs. And I'm looking at the other two of the bedrooms downstairs. Remember, this is a four-bedroom home. And once we come over to the other side of the home, we see that we have a bedroom in this that seats at the front of the house. This bedroom has very high ceilings. It gives it more spacing. It shares a bathroom with the secondary bedroom on this side of the home. Full bath and tub, or a tub and shower, toilet, sink. That flows into the other bedroom, the third bedroom of the home, that also has very high ceilings that gives it a lot of space and gives it a feel of that you're not crowded in. So it makes the room feel a lot bigger than it is. Now, before we go see the piece there is this house, master suite, let's take a look at what would be for me, the piece de la resistance part B, which is, as we come from the family room, it is a sunroom. I love, personally, sunrooms, complete with tile floors, plenty of windows, very high ceilings. This is that space. You grow some plants. You have some seating. If you don't, this is this is your library. This is your space away from everybody else. So just enjoy the day, the moment. You know, it's a great space in the sun. You can also use it for a gym, or an office, or anything of that nature as well. Now, right off of the sun room, as well as you can come through the formal living room, the family room as well, we go into our deck. And as you see, this home is four-sided brick. It's a nice slab for barbecues. We have an overhead trellis set up. And you do have a wood line from the rest of from your neighbors. So you can enter here from the family room or through the sun room. And so now let's go across and see the piece that are the stones, the master suite. All right, guys, now for the piece that are the stones, the master suite. So as we come in to this master suite, I love the fact that it has high ceilings, vaulted ceilings. But what you see is that it create they created a separate sitting area within the master suite that is almost, it is walking into another room. It's not an almost, it's walking into another room that has its own door, privacy door to its own um, private slab deck outside. So you would have your private, away from the rest of the family, your private deck for just you, your spouse to enjoy your day and your time with each other. And as we go across, we see that the room is very large, plenty of room for uh, your bed, since that's going to be your sitting area. And when you see the two closets, you don't even need dressers in it if you don't want it. But as we come into the, that area, we have two. And of course, this is his, that's hers. You want to guess why? As soon as you take a look, you'll know why. Oh, it's a very nice size, plenty of space. She can put all his suits, clothes, everything in there, and shoes. But ah, alas, she has the larger one. This is why this is hers. <laughs> it's just reality. But as we walk in, we see that we come straight to a beautifully modern style bathroom with a very large tub. This tub is big enough, jacuzzi tub, two people easily. You can enjoy a nice time just enjoying each other's company. We have his, well, we have a private toilet first. Then we have his sink. And of course, the reason why this is his sink, because this over here is her sink with the vanity built in. And of course, 
we have a very nice size, very modern looking shower with a beautiful shower head that gives you multiple different positions that you can have with your shower head. So guys, this is a wonderful home. This home will not stay on the market that long, I guarantee you. So if this home struck you, this home makes you say, that's where I want to be, that's where I want to build my family, then contact me, Lorenzo Reed with Remax Metro Cityside, and let me help you to make this your home sweet home.